What's going on everyone? Mohawk Matt, another quick chat for you today. And today I have got the newly minted three-star Admiral Galinas. How are you doing today, sir? Good, Matt, thanks. It's good to be here. Hey, it's good to have you. And he is the commander of Naval Sea Systems Command, correct? Yes, sir. And he's gonna tell you a little bit about himself and what they do and what he's got going up in his head, head up there. Yeah, hey, great, uh, Matt. Thanks again for being here and uh, having you. me here. This is, this is awesome, but uh, yeah, the Naval Sea Systems Command, right? So the, uh, the Navy's engineering directorate for uh, surface ships, submarines, aircraft carriers, and weapon systems. And, uh, you know, our mission is to uh, design, build, deliver, and sustain our, uh, our surface and submarine fleet and the systems that go on those, those platforms. And, uh, you know, a tremendous team uh, with uh, a group located here in Washington, D.C. Um, we also work in the uh, public shipyards around the country. Uh, we have four of those, one up in uh, Portsmouth, New Hampshire, uh, down in Norfolk, uh, one up in Puget Sound, Washington, and out in Pearl Harbor. Um, in conjunction with that, we have uh, regional maintenance centers, which do a lot of the work on our surface ships, the maintenance work on our surface ships. Um, and again, those are located literally around the world in the fleet concentration areas. Uh, we also work very closely with our program executive officers that are uh, affiliated with NAVC, so that's uh, PEO ships, PEO unmanned and small surface combatants, uh, PEO carriers, PEO submarines, and PEO integrated warfare systems. So that's the, uh, the surface, the submarine, and the carrier and the weapon system piece of, of what we do. And um, we, have, we also have the uh, supervisor of shipbuilding organizations that work pr principally in our new construction shipyards for the, uh, the ships, the submarines, and the aircraft carriers that we're building. Um, and then a big part of what we do also is, uh, you know, technology development and uh, technical support for the fleet done principally through our, our naval surface yeah. and undersea warfare centers. 10 warfare centers, warfare centers 10 correct? 10 warfare centers located around the country. So um, that's a lot. Team. It is, it, 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 a big team, uh, very, very good team, very skilled team. Uh, you know, as I, as I come into the job, um, you know, two things that we're really kind of talking about is, uh, one, executing the mission of the Naval Sea Systems Command, which again is to, uh, you know, uh, design, build, deliver and sustain our Design, fleet. build, deliver, sustain the fleet. You heard it right there. There you go, okay. And then the second part really is, is building our team and, uh, and really the health of the team. And that's, um, you know, kind of the discussion is on building a team to compete and win. And uh, it, it really gets down to, um, you know, really kind of providing uh, people across the enterprise uh, the opportunities to, uh, to advance, uh, to, to really um, believe and know that they have kind of a, on a level playing field uh, across our enterprise, the opportunity to, to advance uh, professionally and personally while they're working for the Naval Sea Systems Command Enterprise. That's incredible. You really, you really hit on that team and that people you kind of kept saying. And how important to you as a new commander of a new organization that you're, obviously you've been around, but now that you're over, are people to you? Yeah, so it's, it's one of our top priorities, right? So, um, you know, in, in addition to the, the technical work um, that, the, that the team does, you know, building that team and the health of that team is, is so important. I mean, uh, it, it's no secret that in today's world we are in a, a very, very competitive uh, environment for talent. Um, and, and so, you know, from our most junior, you know, uh, person, engineer, uh, contract specialist, finance person, program uh, manager, um, right on up through, uh, you know, our, our senior folks. Um, and development of every step of the way. And what we talk about is really development in two areas. You know, it's, it's a technical competence, which is really foundation to what the Naval Sea Systems Command does, as well as developing leaders. And we talk about leadership at every level, right? And so as people come up, um, we want them really to be technical leaders across the enterprise. That's fantastic. And it's really empowering for someone. I've only been in the government for seven years, eight years. Yeah. It's, super, it's very empowering to hear that coming from a three-star, coming from your level that because sometimes you, there's, where I'm doing my work, you're doing your work. We don't always know what each other's thinking, and it's yeah. it's really yeah, empowering. Yeah, and, and I'll tell you, I mean, it's 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 an area that of our business that we're never done, right? You're you're never done, um, you know, building that that uh, constructive culture, you know, that's based on trust and integrity and, and toughness and technical competence, right? Definitely. Um, you know, you just it's it's something you got to continue to do, um, you know, clearly. Uh, you know, where we are today is a lot different than where we were, you know, four months ago, right? Yes, With sir. The, the COVID situation, you know, the, the ongoing discussion for on equality for all. And, and so, you know, that all kind of factors into uh, into what we do and 
terms of the health of our team and, and building that team going forward. Fantastic, sir. Is there anything else that, so coming from uh, Oregon, I came from, at Naval X, we're all rotationals, and um, I come from Nav Air, yeah. under weapons division where I've been the last few years. I barely even knew Nav C existed. <laughs> um, Is that right? Yeah. Other yeah. than there being yeah. that you had boats and water, yeah. I had no idea what they even did. Yeah. So, so I'll tell you, so, so for anybody out there, um, a lot of good opportunities within the Naval, Naval Sea Systems Command. Um, you know, go to, go to our website, you can, you can Google uh, Nav C, Naval Sea Systems Command, a lot of information out there. If you're interested in opportunities, uh, either in the engineering side, business, which includes uh, contracting, and finance, uh, or, or program management. Uh, you know, there's a lot of opportunities and literally around the country at, uh, like I said, our warfare centers, regional maintenance centers, supervisors of shipbuilding, shipyards, just a, a lot of great opportunity out there. And, you know, we're thankful, we, we've got a great team. Um, what I would tell you is that NAVC is the best in, it, in the world at what we do, <laughs> okay? And, uh, and I truly mean that. And so uh, for the NAVC team out there, again, I, I thank you all for what you do. And uh, again, Matt, thanks for the opportunity to be here today. Definitely, sir. We'll do okay. one of these in the new there environment that we're Fantastic. in. Fantastic. There we go. Good deal. Thanks everyone, you heard it here. Reach out if you want to know more about NAVC. Follow what the Admiral said, check out their website, and talk to you soon.